about health care. It isn't about valuing life. It isn't about health care. I, I concur. It is about the right to murder. It is about murder. I agree. I agree. Uh, me and Screwtape agree about something. It is all about largely white here men making these laws help the law. And here's here's the unhingedness. I'm going to just let her go because she's just going to come unhinged. And I like to let Brittany be super unhinged because she 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 self defeats her own argument when she gets all angry and amped up. So let's just let her go. I'm going to still comment though because screw tape is what I, I like to smash screw tape. Let's go. And it isn't about health care. It isn't about valuing life. It is all about largely white men making these laws helped along by the, the sort of duped religious right to control women's bodies and to control reproductive access and reproductive. So she's got to she's got to make it something wicked and nefarious, like oh they're trying to control women's bodies. Never mind the little woman's body or the little man's body that's inside the mom. Don't say anything. Productive care. And as Lori pointed out, when we talk about reproductive justice in our communities, let's remember that we have always, as a Black community, particularly Black women reproductive justice activists, have said, when we say reproductive justice, we mean the right to parent or to not parent and to parent one's children in safe and healthy environments. So murder babies. We, we, when we say reproductive justice, we mean we want to be able to murder babies. What's wrong with your heart? What's wrong with your heart? This is the culture of death. This is the death squad. This is the murder. This is this is worse than any mafioso, any cartel, any gang, anyone. They are about murder. That's all they are about. That is what is on the chopping block here. And in case our folks really don't. And let me just call out Wormwood over here acting like she's saying something profound. You can see like you're about murdering babies. Baby, you are about murdering children. And you got the audacity to be snapping like she doing like she's saying something. You got some wickedness in your heart, but don't worry, screw tape is about to really tor torque my screws. Think that this is about, you know, some old school kind of racist strategy. Let's remember that one of the ways that our country enacted slavery really? this is how they gonna pull it up. was to control their reproduction. And so really? you have a Supreme Court largely really? led by conservatives that is saying to us again in 2021 that you don't have the right to determine what happens with your body. And, th and they're also doing it at 15 weeks, which is basically saying that before there's even any possibility of fetal viability outside of the womb, we're going to restrict your ability to make choices about b blood of your blood, flesh of your flesh, bone of your bone, right? Um, I'm sorry, Brittany, uh, screw tape. I'm calling you to repent. She, she's trying to make an analogy. She, you, you heard it, bone of my bone and flesh of my flesh, uh, um, playing off of and riffing off of Adam when he saw Eve in the garden. That's just wicked. That's wicked. That, that's satanic that you would use God's holy word when Adam professed that Eve was his wife to your justification for murdering babies. <sighs> Screw tape. Screw tape. You got to, you could do better than the screw tape, but that's okay because I know that you're panicking. I know you're panicking. I know you're worried over there, Wormwood. I know it. You see it on her face. She's worried. You see it in Britney's. You hear it in Britney's voice. She's worried. She knows that this is going to go south. And their God uh, that they have sacrificed babies to is not going to be appeased anymore. And they got to find a new way to, to, to appease their wicked, evil, idolatrous mindsets. Right. And we get caught up in the moral arguments about this. And this isn't about that. This is about our right to. Wait, wait. So she's trying to take it. She's trying to take it out of the moral sphere. But she's been making moral claims from the beginning. Y'all, they're panicking. I'm going to say it again. I'm looking at my man's face right here. He's looking like, man, we, we sunk. We sunk, man. We are in some deep kimchi. I don't know how to get out of here. We get caught up in the moral argument about this, and this isn't about that. This is about our right to have self determination our right and autonomy. To murder and babies. it is also about Lori's point, which is we want to build strong, healthy black families. When these Republicans. How are you building families when you're murdering their children? I, I totally. This is, this is also a very. Um, and though I've been playing off of the screw tape analogy, this is also a very good example of gaslighting. They're doing something and telling you that it's not actually happening. 
Like we're murdering black and brown babies. We're murdering minority babies, but we're about family. And say that this is, you know, that abortions have killed so many black babies. Y'all know they don't care about black babies. What in their in their policy <laughs> agenda is cares about black babies? Wait, 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 wait. So you're saying that they don't care about black babies, but you're the ones that actually want to kill them. <laughs> black and brown people are the ones that are actually trying to kill them. Wow, gaslighting one on one. I never knew the screw tape was going to drop some gaslighting like that. I did not even pay attention. I got back that little taste. I hate listening to him. I got to do it. When these Republicans say that this is, you know, that abortions have killed so many black babies, they, they, have, know they don't care about black babies. Really? What in their in their policy <laughs> agenda is cares about black babies? Watch they this don't one. care about our family. Here, com here comes the unhingedness. Uh, well, the more unhingedness. I, I don't know. She, she's got so much unhingedness that she's about to jam into this last little 40 seconds. Watch, just strap in. He's right. They care about their right to control. <laughs> and let me add one last thing. They also care about making white women have more children. This is also about their own demographic anxiety because we know that white populations are rapidly becoming the minority because of capitalist structures, folks that part. can't support these families. And because of that, they need white women to have more babies and white women are like, look, but we can't support these kids. Uh, you know, we, we can't give them these middle-class lifestyles. Uh we're not talking primarily only about the abortion or murder of brown and, and black babies. Are you honestly saying <laughs> screw tape? I'm sorry, screw tape. You done came unhinged. Woo. So that's what's going on here. And if that means that you have to then take away reproductive access for women of color as a byproduct of trying to control everybody's reproduction, then these men are up for the task. And we've got to stand up and we've got to say, wow. hell no. Nope. Dr. Whew, Dr. Cooper talking Screw that tape. Brittany and Lloyd, thank you so much. Screw tape. For joining and Wormwood, uh, appreciate you.